half past seven. I have already been out for a run and I am just heading out to get some fruit from the local market. The hotel does do breakfast, but I kind of feel like fruit this morning, like either some mango or papaya or something. So we're gonna head down, get some fruit. Stephen is still asleep, of course. We are leaving Georgetown today. We're actually staying in Penang. I think I mentioned yesterday about staying in Penang. We're gonna head up to Batafrangi, which is where the beach is. We're gonna have a few beach days, I think. So I think we'll just sort of whenever, I think checkout time is 12. So whenever sort of Stephen wakes up and we're organized, we're gonna try and grab the bus. Although we weren't really successful grabbing the bus the other day, so it might be an Uber. We'll see. It's maybe about seven kilometers away, but We'll see, either bus or Uber over there. And I've got one night booked in a hotel. Here's our little fruit market. I might go for papaya. up now it's only half 10 and so i think possibly we might just go and sit downstairs in the lobby for a little bit i don't think we can check in to the hotel till two o'clock i think i said we're, we're going to arrive between one and two uh, but on their website it says we're going to check in at two but quite often they let you check in earlier but um yeah i think we might just go and sit downstairs in the lobby area for maybe an hour or so before we head over to Batu Furangi. I still haven't decided whether we should get a bus or an Uber. What do you think, Stephen? I know what you're gonna say, actually. Yeah. Uber? <laughs> we'll probably do an Uber. I just looked before, the Uber is like 16 uh, ringgit. I think the bus is like three each. So the difference is 10, which is like, what, 180 or something? It's not breaking the bank to take an Uber. We are checking out car. behind the mirror. Yeah, it's not hanging up on there, is there? Okay, shut it up. We're here, we're gonna go and check in. Beach Maybe. is like just opposite. Maybe check in, yeah, hopefully. It's like one o'clock, so we should be able to. Baba guest house. That's where we're staying. Just for the one night, I think. Depending on how nice it is. We are in, I think. We may check the Wi-Fi, what the Wi-Fi is like. And then probably just go to the beach, maybe. There's a little shared balcony area and like i said yeah the beach is just there which is the reason why i booked this place it was the cheapest closest to the beach place we'll see how it is for one night if it's any good like i said we'll book it for more nights if not we might have to go away from the beach a little bit we'll see Just uh, let's see what this beach is like No waves, Steve wanted waves, didn't he? Yeah. What's a banana thing? Oh, I thought you meant like actual bananas. Whoa. So here is Bato Ferengi Beach. Okay, I'm gonna check out the sea. We do 
Oh my god, it's so warm. Like, it's so warm. It's so warm. Yeah. The great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes. The day has begun. You spin around, you spin around, you laugh to yourself. And I see you shine in every color, resting your head in my arms. You see? We're going to have a little walk down the beach. So quiet. I wonder whether we're like we're completely out of season or what the deal is. Like everything's closed up. Shop, bought a big bunch of bananas. I'm gonna go make a banana smoothie, I think. I'm getting a little bit hungry. Got milk. I'm gonna need water. I made banana smoothies for us both. I've drank mine. Stephen's having his. Is it nice? Yeah. Good. I'm just heading out on a little walk. I've left Stephen back at the apartment. I am kind of just gonna suss out what's around. I'm also gonna go and check out, I think, another hotel. It's just further up here to stay in for the next couple of nights. I've been so busy since we've been back at the apartment um, trying to suss out what we're doing next. And plans are changing again. Like the original plan, I think I've spoken about it, the original plan was maybe to try and get somewhere with the pool here and then maybe go up to Langkawi before we head up to Chiang Mai. But that is changing, I think, that potentially now we might be going uh, like spending a couple of days here just in like a cheap crappy hotel not bothering with the pool or anything and then getting a flight up to Phuket I was really thinking of Koh Lanta but maybe Phuket now I'm not entirely sure there's a I don't know don't really know there's so many options but I don't know at the moment what I'm doing I'll have to um I'll figure it out later on this evening I think the reason why we were initially staying in Malaysia was because when we go up to Chiang Mai we're doing a work away there and I wanted to be doing that for a month, four weeks uh, and we've only have UK passports have 30 days visa exemption and so I didn't want to head into Thailand first for any of the islands and get like spend a week there and then only be able to spend three weeks up in Chiang Mai at our work away but either we'll do it like that or you can get a visa extension and I don't know it's so much cheaper in Thailand it was just ridiculous like I've just been having a look at the places we want in Langkawi like hotels where minimum of like £25 a night with them um, near the beach with the pool and I was looking at some of the Thai islands and you can literally get something for like £5 a night which is just seems ridiculous to me so obviously we'll have to pay to fly up there, but I was just looking at flights from Phuket, not from Phuket, from Penang to Phuket, and flights about is it fifty pound each, sixty pound each? So not too bad. I'm gonna head and walk along the beach. I think. I could get Stephen some more shorts while she was here, couldn't I? I'm not gonna. Okay, this bit of the beach is a bit busier. Or maybe it's just the time of day now, the sun's gone a little bit. There's a few people down here. Because we're all the way up there near the end of the beach. And I see you shine in every color, resting your head in my arms. You see me. Back on the beach, we're heading out to go and get some tea. We found somewhere to eat. We've come to Bora Bora. Yeah, Bora Bora it's called. I wanted a table down there, but they've all gone. Actually, 
actually we could sit on that and pass it quite yeah we're moving to the beach it is not a bad view to eat our tea and there's just a random horse along the beach run away <laughs> Mango juice, it's even got an orange that looks like bright, bright orange. <laughs> Food arrived. Stephen's gone for spag ball. Nice. Is it nice? It's not like any normal spag ball, it's like, like bacon. And I'm having salad and potato. And look at that sky. Oh, it's nice having tea on the beach. We're gonna head home now. I booked that other hotel, by the way, that I said before. So tomorrow we are moving. Hotels, we're staying here, but we're just moving like just down the road to be honest. It's like three minutes walk or something away from our other hotel, so not too bad. <laughs> 